Good morning, everyone. This is Kathleen at Be Again Books, and I am here to share this little uh, vintage junk journal with you. It's small. It's one signature, and it has a recycled book cover. Bob's Merrill, first reader from the state of Kansas, and I will tell you that it is, let's see, I have the, the first page. It was printed, published in 1926, so the copyright is 1923, so that's how old this book is, and I haven't done much to the cover just because I like, I like that and wanted to leave it. I just made a simple button closure. Was pretty happy when I found these buttons that would match so well. Inside, I have left this, who it belonged to, Emmy Jo, in 1927, it looks like. She owned it. And I've just made a little embellishment with these vintage postage stamps, and this is a vintage time check card. I have included a lot of vintage type ephemera in here. So let me show you what I've got. Here is, as I say, that first book page and just a note paper in this side pocket. Just some vintage images. I have some coffee dyed paper and some of the paper is contrast white. Here is some other just vintage book page uh, flash card, which is so appropriate for this school book. The stub of a vintage check. And this is just a little um, fabric, very pretty um, beaded fabric as a belly band and just some little printed ephemera there. I love this. These ladies. Some note paper there. Some lace. This is some antique lace. Really nice. I love this lace. This is just a collage. It's not a tuck or anything, just an embellishment on this page. There is some, some texture paste here on the edge. This is the belly band. Some journaling cards. This one has some texture paste. Some embossing. All through this journal, I have splattered some paint, just as an embellishment, some washi tape. This is a coffee dyed envelope. Another envelope and a vintage check. This has a little pull tab card comes out. This is the other side of the envelope and that holds some ephemera. This is flip. Another junk mail envelope with some embossing and stenciling. It's just a card that fits in that envelope. Just a little collage on that page. An index card. This is um, just some journaling paper, some of that old um, pencil pad paper that school children use. 
which I thought would fit in here very nicely. This is just a little collage tag with a pin. Some more vintage ephemera. In this pretty pocket. This is one of my little peekaboo side tucks with some a playing card and just a little collage. Here's some other tags to go in there. And that's the end. It's kind of small and simple, but just right. And it feels so good in your hand. Thanks for watching.